myself equipped. Let's see how this match is going to play out. This is a race of two. Again, this is loser's bracket action. Loser of this set will be out of the tournament at seventh place. Oof. Crazy to think that Arslan and Kokoma are both sent to losers here. Yeah. Only one will survive. We're going to the Vermilion Gates. Home field advantage for Kunimitsu. Are we going to get the special intro? Let's find out. And I'm going to guess that Fang's going to be yelling at some fists. Oh, yeah. Hopefully the crowd will yell with Feng Wei. There it is. Oh, yeah. I approve. There it is again. The follow-up here. Jump into action. Menacing. That is such a cool oh, intro, dude. <laughs> Kitsune action. Starting things off. We'll have the second hit. Didn't believe, though. And Arson is so good at mixing up the poke options here. And you'll see that throughout the day as he kind of tests his opponent to see how they're going to react. And again, this is the bottom. poke options. Yeah, perfectly used. Down for 1 3. He's been landing a lot of those this weekend. Gets him with a grab here, looking to close it out. One more hit could do it. Okay, down back three, no perfect for you. KO. Just a jab, check him. Arson wow. after the first round. Yeah. Fight. Looking really, really strong here as he goes into it. One plus two throw, no break. The throws have been so far very, very effective in the matchup. It's only been one round, that, two rounds, it's crazy. Yeah. Gathered a lot of data off of that. Wow, look at this. It just. His aggressive rush out has really what evolved the over the past few events. The way he's been utilizing Kunimitsu is really, really highlighting his aggressive play style. Right, I think it really complements his play style for sure. Yeah, when especially because it's so hard to react to the small, uh, the small inputs that she's doing. Chases down the back tempo with the force of forward two. Not giving Kokoma any breathing room. Yeah, it's not looking good for Kokoma right now. Arson Ash is on a tear. Look at that, playing at range zero, really testing his opponent. Kokuma's gonna have to start utilizing some other tools. You know, has he even gone for reverse Kempo at all? Maybe he deems it too risky here. Ooh, he was ready to duck on the first try. And Kokuma was the only Feng player that I really see using 1-3 as a standing poke. Yeah, and it's kind of dangerous too because it doesn't gel on like the or something. Yeah. Maybe oh. try to bait him. Maybe try to do the slower 1-1 one, one or something. Who knows? The resplat. He has all the low scouted from Kokoma as well. He's not even letting him do down back three. Yeah. Not yeah. giving him a chance, but nice. Great Counter presence of mind there. Counter it up 4-2. Gets the mini combo with the shoulder at the wall. Again, 100% block rate on the down back three. What are you supposed to do? I, I, honestly, he completely shut him down. Kokoma had no chance to get in. Anytime he tried to take the offense back, Arson was ready. And Arson moving so quick. You see the flurry of mix-ups that he's doing in his face. Goes for the wall signing one, goes for the jab, goes for other ways to kind of set up the down forward one series. And he was really able to showcase like, hey, if you're not ready for this, I'm going to rush you down. And yeah, that, that set stance from Kunimitsu really complements Arson's play style. Yeah. Able to close the distance at a moment's notice. You can end up in full crowd. You could use the moves out of it. And let's talk about how effective his throw game was out of it as well. He yeah. really made a count. He's had a one plus two throw and a one throw out of the stance as well. So plenty of options out of that stance. All right. Kokuma's going to have another chance here, but he has to turn things around. If he's not able to do it, he's going to be out of the tournament. Final chance for Kokoma here. Brimstone and fire is the stage. Let's see if it works out for him. All right, going into this. Arson Ash loses bracket run. He needs one more game to move forward. Kokoma here, hoping to make a difference. The crowd, of course, with their approval. <laughs> Sancho this. Round one. Here we go, game number two. Arson up one. All right, let's see what what are we gonna have different here in the game. Nice. nice. That's that's one big difference here. But again, the poke that Arson went to was kind of unorthodox. It's not something he utilized what a early good on. That still hits. Combo. That still hit. Oh my gosh. And look at that. This is a huge lead. Kokoma is doing a great job here in this opening round. Probably looking to get his first round on the score, but he has to be careful. He's back to the wall. Oh, man. He's got to find a way out. He's fighting his way out right now. That's what we do with that. While setting one is so good here. Looks like Kokoma calmed down, and he's going for the mids now, but Arslan just keeping him there. Oh, he tried to bait him, but I don't think he pressed. Great bait. Up back, too, for the punish. That's a rare move that you don't round see very often. Two. Yeah. Wanted to show he has he has knowledge. <laughs> he knows what moves to use. I got some cool fang moves to show you guys. Yeah. Goes in for the dash down 4-3, not able to land it here. But a big Ooh, test. Wow, great. he just went for it. And the trade, I, I would say that was a worthwhile trade. 
Absolutely. Both of them not getting anything off of that. Nice forward forward two approach here. Here comes Kokuma. He does have a slight life lead, gets a big counter hit. There's That's the first counter. time we've seen him get the counter hit on it. First time it even connected. He walked every single one in game one. Gotta watch out for that. Teleport dive kick here. Something that lands counter leads to massive damage as well. Has to be careful. Arson with the rage here. You gotta watch out for that big sweep. You gotta watch out for the rage drive. A lot to think about here. Well, pushing it towards the wall with the rage drive. Set three again into the down jab. It is zero on hit. He wanted every advantage that he could take. Oh, the one throw had it. Break. Oh, he's it's gonna get it. Turn three for the low crush. So Not smart. What's up, chip damage? Kokoma utilizing that rage drive. Chip Round damage. Three. Perfectly. He had him in burnout state and hit him with the <laughs> chip damage. That was crazy. He hit him with the drive inside like on the wall. What? All right, here's the follow-up. He gets it down four or three. He's going to be pushing. Not going to be able to get the wall, though. Let's see what mix. Headbutt pressure, plus yeah. four, forces crowd. A complete turnaround. You guys got to think about it. Two rounds straight, that's not easy, especially against Arsene Nash. How's he doing it? Down four, one was counter hit, but Arsene Nash didn't believe. He's changing up the rhythm, the way he's attacking, but the back two able to eat the fish hook. Let's see what he does here right now. Arsene Nash with a slight life lead. Trying to close the gap with the crowd stash while standing one. He tried to catch him with a headbutt there. Wasn't a, able to do it, but a great reaction there from Arsene Ash. He ooh, knows exactly what the punishment. Counter hits the power crush attempt from Arsene with the down back three. Oh, yeah. Oh, what a got to run. Three. Oh, wow. What a sequence there. I mean, that was a forced scramble he had to guess there. But look at that. Two rounds to one. Arsene Ash fighting back now. 2-1, forcing Arsene Ash into full crouch. Arsene Ash should take the generic four, down four from full crouch there to close out the round. Back to the neutral game, not letting him do a generic down four of his own. Look at the press here, goes for the headbutt. The life lead with Arsene Ash here, looking to tie things up on rounds. Oh, just checking him with the dive kick, not committing to the second part. Uh, Kokoma has a chance on the second hit. He's going to get the kunai afterwards as well. Oh, oh my god! Counter hit set point for Arslan. This is big. This round very decisive here. What's gonna happen between these two? The Either first two rounds look so strong for Kokoma too, but Arslan Ash able to adapt on the fly in, within the game. I mean that's why he's the best. Second hit of the one-three, able to land counter hit. But wasn't able to get the little mini flow conversion. Down back three, counter hit again. And Kokuma taking the timing back once more. Has a nice lead here. Can he capitalize? Can he take it? Will he take it to the final game? Woo! Getting brave with the low. Oh, she has rage. Again. Oh, and one mix. Not nice patience enough. there from Arslan. Arslan's gonna go crazy. He's gonna do something nuts. Headbutt into fish hook. Arslan doesn't bite. It's so hard to close him out. Do I go low? I don't want to go low. What if he low parries? Oh my God! What are you gonna do? Oh. 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 He almost got lit up. Wow! He charged up the rage drive. He almost got lit up, but Kokuma staying alive here takes that round. Takes it to a final game now. Oh. Takes the last swig of his tea there. Final, final round opportunity oh. here. Oh, Arson rethinking that last match over. And is he gonna pick two. the classic? Is he gonna go to open stage? How is he gonna deal with this? Oh, he, he is. is. He's gonna highlight the infinite azure too, looking to close things out there. This is where it's gonna come into play. Final game. Woo. Kokuma, man, he made some great adjustments. Both of these crazy. players were making yeah. adjustments on the fly, but of course, it came down to timing. He got early on, he got every single down back, launched, punished. Absolutely. But still, that's not gonna deter me from going for it. Yeah. He started landing on counter it. He was getting a good read on the timing, and again, did not fall for any of the, the, the fishing. But the yeah, yeah, let's talk to the fish. Hyped. Yes. Anyways, we're gonna go back into this. This is the final game. But yeah, you're absolutely right, Mark. In game number two, the switch up on the timing really turned it around for Kokoma there. He's gonna be able to do it again. It's a tall order. It is a tall order. Let's see if he can pull it off. Right now, he has a life lead. Keep, keeping it honest here with the fish hook. No funny business. 12 frame mid with great tracking. Oh, the second hit again. Gets the oh, got the mini combo this time. It didn't even actually combo. He could have tech rolled off of that. Yeah. And because of how active is in terms of reactions with Arson Ash, sometimes that 1-3 can prove to be a detriment here in the particular matchup. Kokuma Take making it count. Lead. Making it count. He has the first lead right now. Again, the 1-3s are working for and, days. And he knows the range, too. He knows not to overcommit. Oh, I feel like Arson has to go nuts at some point. Here comes the set, too. They're trying to chase down that back tempo with that set stance. Slides in. Wow, opportunity. Again. What is going on? Yeah. Again, that wasn't a true combo. He could temporal that hit. But look at the awareness and the presence of mind. He's going to go for it. He's going to hit. And he's going to follow up. Right? Whoa. Oh, my gosh. Oh, 
right. Again, both of these players jockeying for that position. Arsenal dealing with the deficit, but he has rage. Oh, oh what a whip one. That was crazy. He wants to end it with a low. Again, another low running three. Oh, he makes went the for it. Hop kick. Wow. Nice wow. movement from Kokuma, but a good dash block reaction. Here we go. Set point, Kokuma. Will he move on in the loser side? The wow. train. Train set to still gets a combo. Just without the pretty animation, but still able to make things happen. Dashes right through to the other side. Arsene wow. Ash with the advantage right now. Bunch of set stands coming out of Arsene Ash. Closing the distance, not letting Kokuma back away, but finds a counter hit headbutt. Gotta watch out, these lows are starting to come out. Kokuma smelling blood. Well, just a single jab check. He noticed that it whips, but he doesn't overextend. Nice wall standing one from Arsenal. Puts him into the red. You gotta nice be careful, though. On the third hit. One launch could end things here. Oh! oh! Gotta be careful. to be countered oh, there. One, one plus, plus four! four. Ah! Damn you, ah! not ah! dead! Ah! One standing one's gonna do it! Kokoma takes the set over Arsenal as 3 0 in rounds in game number three. Wow, the approval from the crowd. They're making some noise. Hype for their man. Man, but guys, we got to give it up. Seventh place all the way from Pakistan. Arsene Ash, guys, got to give it up. Really happy that he made it out to this event. Of course, he's going to get a little bit more points. A true competitor here, Arsene Ash, entering three different titles here this weekend. Yeah, I'm sure he's doing well in all of them. Again, a nice placement here. But man, Kokuma is living and he's moving on in the loser side of the bracket. Man, got to give it up. He made it. That was a crazy comeback because he got destroyed. That